Here's where you make your decisions. Now he's got a lot on his mind. Do you go with this kid or do you bring in Lane? Well, he's showing a lot of confidence in the youngster. Pitch one on drive deep to right field. Williams on his horse. The ball is gone over the right field wall. A grand slam home run for Scott Stanley. And the Wildcats are alive and kicking here in Omaha, Nebraska. Infield looking for the double play, of course. Brumley like to bail himself out. Single picked off in a throwing error. And he's bailed himself out as back goes Waters. And it is gone. A grand slam home run bails him out. 4 2 Texas. There's a happy young man circling the bases. left field back to the warning track that one rattles the board as it gets out of here a grand slam home run by Mike DeBenham you definitely do not want to throw the ball up in the strike zone or, or above in this situation you want a ground ball so you have to get the ball down Driving deep to right field. Back to the warning track. The wall, it's gone. A grand slam home run by Paul Sorrento. When you get behind good hitters, and Paul Sorrento is a good hitter, and you have to throw the fastball down the middle, he's going to put a charge in it. It's just a matter of how high he gets it. Bases loaded for Stanford. Left-hander's cap, Sam. <laughs> Fastball hit high in the air, deep to left field, way back there, gone! A grand slam homer! Stanford wins! The Stanford Cardinals stay alive on a grand slam homer! by Paul Carey and Paul McDonald absolutely beside himself. Jim Osborne. Hit hard, deep to left field. Way back, it's going, it's gone. A grand slam homer for Jim Osborne. And Cal State Fullerton leads nine to three. You can see him. Looks like he's a deep short with a power right hand hitter up. Sometimes that winds up to 20 miles an hour. Another breaking ball hit the deep left. Way back. Grand slam. His second home run of the College World Series. He has six RBIs and he has put the Titans on top four to nothing. And boy, did he get all of that one. One and one from Chris Bauer. Hit a ton to left. Goodbye, Grand Slam. The fifth home run of the year for Tim Lanier. The previous highlight of his batting season had been a career high five RBIs against Georgia Tech in the regional. This one will take first prize. Here's the 1 1. And a drive hit deep to the center field. Way back at Taft has hit a grand slam home run to tie this game. Alabama. Comes back to pull even. A grand slam by the shortstop Brett Taft. His second home run in as many innings.
out in front of him where he can really do some damage with it. One ball, no strikes to count to Hokusang. The pitch, and there's a drive. Hit deep to left. Davis back, and that ball is gone. Brand new game. Grand slam for Hokusang. And let's see what happens to Stanford now because this is a huge boost for them. Well, they thought they were just absolutely buried coming into a situation where Hokusang goes big fly and has them believing that they are right back in this game. But it puts him behind. It's 1 0. Tying runs in scoring position. Oh Excellent hard. Breaking back is Rudy Arguez. He's looking up. Climbs the wall. It's gone. A grand slam home run for Florida State's Jeremy Salazar. What a game for him. A two run shot and now a grand slam homer. And so the long ball that carried them to the regional title has surfaced here in the sixth inning. Crumpton's a junior. Junior college transfer. He's from Mesquite, Texas. Lane gets it high in the air and deep in center field. Arguez lands. He can't do it. Jason Lane sets the College World Series record for hits in the World Series with a great. Last two times, an infield hit last time. Oh, pitch is launched to right. Dan Wilson back. And we have our first grand slam of the 2001 College World Series. That's going to be quite a thrill for a redshirt freshman. go out there and they do the same thing they do early in the ball game. They don't try to speed it up. They actually try to slow the game down. He got a hanger and he hammers it. Deep left, way back, gone! Grand slam and Carolina takes a four run lead in the ninth. in left field, gapping. That one is going to go over the wall, a grand slam, and the first one ever at TD Ameritrade. As a hitter, all you can do right now is look for something up. 
and make that adjustment. Driven deep to left field. McGee looking up. He won't get to it. It is gone. A grand slam for the number nine hitter, Jordan Westberg. And Mississippi State, instead of waiting until the end of the game, sends a big signal early in this one. Wow, on, an old, on a two-strike pitch.